Goggle, what are you doing here? Ma'am, I have a free period. I was walking by and I saw all these students here. So, I stopped to see what they were doing here on the computers. Okay, Goggle, I'll tell you. Goggle, you can use a computer to do many different things. Look at Anil. He is playing a racing game on the computer. Nowadays, you can play a lot of games like cricket, chess, basketball, racing games or other games on a computer. Now, see, here Rani is using the computer to write a letter to her friend. I thought we always need a pencil and a paper to write a letter. <laughs> that is how you write a letter normally. When you use a computer to write anything, it is called typing. We use the keyboard to write on the computer. When we press any key of the keyboard, the letter, number or the symbol on the key will appear on the screen. Can we draw and paint on the computer? Of course we can. Look at Deepak. He is drawing an elephant on the computer. Wow! That's exciting! You can also use the computer to solve sums the way Sham is doing over there. He is doing a math sum on the computer. Look at Maitri, Ravi and Rita. They are listening to music on the computer at the corner table. You can also watch movies and cartoons on the computer just like Anwar and his friends on the other corner table. So, ma'am, we can do all these things on computers? Yes, we teachers also use the computer to do some other tasks for the school. Like what, ma'am? We prepare question papers for the exams and also the mark sheets on the computer. We also use the computer to teach children of higher classes. You can also use the computer at home to do your homework and also send mails to your friends. Now, what do you think of the computer? Oh, I like it. It's a very useful machine. So many things we can do on it. I will go now, ma'am, or I will be late for class. My free period is nearly over. Thanks for telling me all about the uses of computers. <laughs>